So we're out of the Bellingham station and now heading towards Yeshua Music. So Lewisham Music is an independent charity. We get most of our funding from the Department for Education and Arts Council in England to offer a range of musical opportunities for young people in schools and in the community. My background is as a primary music specialist, but also running creative programmes in the community and uh, as an industry, music industry professional as well. So for me, on a personal level, bringing together my different professional skills was really exciting, being able to connect what we're doing in schools to what we're doing in the community and to connect all of that into the music industry and the talent we have in the borough as well. I'm delighted to be part of Lewisham Music. I joined at a really exciting time when we were waiting to move into the fellowship. Of course that wait grew ever longer in the last 18 months but we're so excited finally to be here. I know living locally that there's a real dearth of local community spaces in the south of the borough and it's great that we're opening this up. We really hope that local young people will come and take advantage of our programme and that you'll come and make of these spaces what you need from us and come and be part of what we're doing here. My initial reaction to seeing the Theon Crossroom is humbled, honestly. Um, I think getting a room named after me is one of the highest honours I've ever received in music and I'm just glad that my name is associated with um, a room where young musicians can flourish you know and, and work on their skills and, and actually um, drive towards their, their dreams and success. <laughs> My name is Nigel Thompson. I'm a drum tutor for Lewisham. Um, I've been with Lewisham for about what, 13 years, teaching, doing mentoring as well, samba, drum kit, djembe, um, loads of percussion basically. So in the fellowship, um, furthering talent on a Monday, um, doing drum kit work with four pupils, which is pretty cool. Um, various abilities, um, all with a goal of improving and um, getting themselves on their musical journey. So yeah, just trying to empower them, give them tools so they can play, perform and do whatever they like in the future. Novelist, 24 years old, I make music, I smile a lot. When I entered the Novelist studio, the first feeling I had was, was I felt at home. The second feeling I had was just, um, I just reminisced on, on the times when I myself as a young person was, was imagining having access to a facility like this. Like if we had this on top of, of, of the struggle that we was going through, it, it just would have been a whole other thing. You know what I mean? So for young people out there, I'll take it for granted. All things are attainable. I give my energy, it's not takeable. I've got a light that's unexplainable. I've got a peace that's unexplainable. Anything dark is erasable. My light is irreplaceable. In this world, I move operational. No fear when it's confrontational. Your heart's got to be shapeable. When the truth comes, it's not escapable. I'm blessed and it's generational. The future is more than sensational. With me, it's invitational. I make moves that are not spectatable. 
unmistakable. The house that I built is not made to fall. I'm ready for the heat and for the rain to fall because with God alone, I'm well able. But I'm Ray Black. I am a singer and songwriter um, from down the road, <laughs> from South East London. My initial reaction to even knowing this Ray Black room existed was definitely like surprise and just feeling a bit overwhelmed to be honest. It's a full circle moment for me having a room named after me. I think this is such a great initiative to give the young people an opportunity to have a place to commune together and be safe and also just be creative and be free and express themselves. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. It goes somewhere else. So the program here at the Fellowship is, is already looking really exciting. We've got five days a week of activity already running. A huge part of how we want that to grow and develop is working directly with communities, working directly with young people to take a lead on what that program looks like. At the moment, we've got um, everything from individual tuition through our bursary program in partnership with Awards for Young Musicians. We've also got um, everything from community choirs, music production sessions, an amazing Samba project with our partners, South London Samba. And this is just the start of what we're able to offer here. My name is Natalie Price and I'm a Relationship Manager in the Music Department for Arts Council England. So I manage MPO clients and I look after music education hubs. So the Fellowship in Start offers an enormous amount of opportunities for emerging artists that are coming from Newsham. Being positioned where it is, it's accessible. It has um, really great resources. It's got recording studios, it's got rehearsal spaces, it's got performance spaces. And for young people having to travel across the borough to access these services, and especially us reaching people in Bellingham and Down and Grove Park, they would have never been able to utilize services locally if it wasn't for the fellowship in I'm Karen Miller, um, Head of Community Engagement at Phoenix. Um, I think this building is absolutely fantastic and we're really happy to work in partnership with Lewisham Music. Fellowship Inn, back in the day, used to host some big bands like Fleetwood mm -hmm. Mac and it was also home to Henry Cooper where he did his, um, where he actually lived here and did some training, didn't he, uh, pre Muhammad Ali fight. So, you know, with that kind of prestige, it's only fitting that Lewisham Music has created this wonderful, you know, creative and inspiring and very colourful um, hub. I'm so excited to see what's going to happen next. Remembering that this building was um, just a pub and to be honest, a fairly run down pub for a long, long time. And uh, but it should be at the heart of the community in Bellingham, which is a great community. So yeah. having the names up. In, on the on the rooms is that it's, it's a message to the young people of this area and the great facilities on the doorstep as yeah. well. to have something like this in your community just coming that's affordable and accessible. Yeah.